Welcome to Red Dead 2 and thanks for joining us. Today we are discussing tips on how to get that perfect banded uh, gila monster. And uh, sometimes this can be a little tricky. Uh, basically this thing is only going to be found in the deserts of New Austin. Now you need to start with a three star banded gila monster in order to have a perfect help. Obviously if you get a good shot off and uh, you know the question is what type of weapon do we need to get that uh, perfect Gia Monster skin? And the answer to that question is the Varmint Rifle. Yep, we're going to use the Varmint Rifle to take care of it. Another question uh, some of us may have is where exactly are we right now? Uh, where's the best spot to catch this thing? You know, you can get it over the desert, but where is the best spot? And after lots of attempts and lots of tries, my best of luck is this little spot along the river. I would say it is south of Fort Mercer, but you can't go directly south of Fort Mercer to get there or you'll fall off a cliff. So you have to, you have to be creative in how you go about it. But uh, this seems to be uh, the spot I had the best of luck here. In fact, we're going to show three examples on uh, how to get these things. While this little area up to the island is a pretty good spot for finding them, these things can be fairly elusive as they're very good at hiding in the brush. you got to use a lot of tracking uh, to try to catch them at least most of the time. And you'll do that by simply pushing in L3 and R3 at the same time to activate tracking. Another feature we're going to use here is Deadeye once we get this thing in, in view. And as you can see on this confrontation right here, it's a little bit tricky getting the shot off while you're riding the horse. That's that, But that's what Dead Eye's for. So you activate it by pushing R3, tag it with R1, and of course, you're going to shoot with R2. And unfortunately, when we go up to the thing, uh, it happens to be still three stars and a uh, perfect Geo Monster, so that's a good thing. Now, as I've said earlier, you can find these things in other spots in the desert, but this spot, uh, I've had my best luck, and that's because there's a narrow band in where they can travel. The tricky part, of course, is getting through the terrain uh, because it can be a little bit challenging. you got to keep your eyes open. Uh, sometimes they use tracking to see, oh, there's one right there. Okay, got the varmint rifle equipped. Going to activate Deadeye again. And uh, keep our fingers crossed that that's the spot for the shot. Yes, we did shoot into brush, so we'll keep our fingers crossed again. Oh, good. It is the perfect Gila monster, so that, that's really good news. Now, when you get one of these things perfect, I would highly recommend you save your game just in case something weird happens. Because you, you never know. You never know what can happen to you in this game. You could get uh, attacked and destroyed by a cougar, and then, of course, you don't have this thing anymore. Now, with any spot you choose to hunt these things, they're fairly elusive at trying to spot. Uh, sometimes, you know, it, it's, a, it's a very quick window in which you see them, as we see this one on the left right there, getting away. Okay, we're going to switch to the varmint rifle. And, like I said earlier, my best of luck is in this stretch, uh, just south of Fort Mercer, kind of along the river. Basically, uh, you want to use a combination of tracking and dead eye. Here we are. We're following it. Okay. Going to follow this line right here. And where is exactly is this thing? Well, that's 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 what makes it tricky. But if you keep uh, use your best tracking skills and stuff and follow this thing. Okay. It looks like it turned around. Eventually, you'll get your share of these things. They're a little bit elusive, but uh, yeah, this is the best best spot to go for them here. As we are going, going, going. Where is that thing? All right. All right. We're close. We got to be close here. Oh, there it is. There it is right there. All right. Dead eye. Fire. Okay. That was a tough one. We'll go ahead and take a look at the replay on the left as we're going up to skin it just so you can see uh, where exactly that shot needs to be. Aiming high uh, near the head area. Got a very small window, of course, uh, but we get that uh, shot off, and of course we get the uh, perfect Gila monster there as we're skinning it. Yeah, this thing is, this thing is, uh, can be very challenging uh, to get at some time, 
But uh, if you want your best of luck, at least for me, go to the spot by the river because it, it keeps them in a small corridor. The tricky part, of course, as I've mentioned probably several times, is the brush. Uh, but if you can use tracking effectively, you're going to have good luck. And, of course, that is going to wrap this up. I am signing out. Thank you for watching. And, of course, good luck.